This tree was planted by President Xi Jinping. Every year as spring approaches, President Xi and billions of Chinese people who have dedicated themselves to China's afforestation efforts see the fruits of their labor. Shovel in hand and shoes in mud, she committed to the harmonious coexistence between humans and nature through a nine-year tree planting project. Lucid waters and lush mountains are invaluable assets. She proposed this guiding theory in 2005 and that endures to this day. And now this acorn has grown into a mighty oak tree. China declared war against pollution. In 2015, a revised environmental protection law featuring stricter provisions came into effect. In 2017, the 19th National Congress of the CPC identified pollution control as one of China's three tough battles. China is weaving eco-friendliness in its path towards the future. In March 2018, ecological civilization was written into the Chinese constitution for the first time. When China made its 14 five-year plan, it outlined a comprehensive approach, transforming socio-economic development strategies for a greener China. An active participant in the global fight against climate change, China pledged to peak carbon dioxide emissions by 2030 and achieve carbon neutrality by 2060. On water pollution, I observed how they have fought water pollution in the Zhejiang province. Uh, they have done in a few years, two, three, four years in, in Zhejiang, what we in Europe did in the Rhine in, in 30 years, turning an extremely polluted area into uh, an area of hope and green tourism. There are more electric buses in the city of Shenzhen alone than there is in the entire world outside China on basically every environment technology. China is now leading at scale. Billions of Chinese people have joined China's endeavor to paint the vast land green, playing a part in the nation's green transformation.